This shop class, much like any other shop class, focuses on building something from scratch that works just as well as something you pay good money for. Zero and lift off. Companies and nations pay hundreds of millions of dollars to build and launch weather satellites. Oh, do you want me to unplug These MIT students have figured out how to do it on the cheap. So you're telling me this is not a scale model of anything. This is the thing. This is the thing, right. Yeah. So this is the actual size. It is It is smaller than most shoe boxes. Dr. Carrie Cahoy runs the MIT Space Systems Lab. Should we run it again? This is Micromass, or the micro-sized microwave atmospheric satellite. Once in space, the tiny satellite will scan tropical storms and hurricanes as it zooms around the planet in low Earth orbit. Um, so that we can get storm updates faster and get better data. Um, that are closer to the Earth physically than the satellites that are further away. Everything's plugged in. This lab is building the thing by hand for less than 1% of what you would pay for a big fancy satellite. The same fundamental technology that you need in your cell phone to receive radio waves we use here in the radiometer payload. It's just a ball and a cushion of air. Building their own zero gravity simulator is not the only way they've cut costs here. The bigger satellites take a lot of more people. Here's one example. The team knew they needed something metal, rigid, yet flexible to use as their antenna to get all the information back down to Earth. Then they realized it was right in their hands. Um, well, it turns out that a tape measure is exactly what you need, and you just kind of bolt it down, and it flops out when we launch from the Peapod. Well, I showed you the Peapod. The Peapod is the way they get it into space. When you say free launch... You, you don't pay for it? <laughs> we don't pay for it. We don't pay for the launch. There's no cost no. for launching no, a rocket not, not into space. Passing one minute, 20 seconds. NASA's Peapod program is basically unused space on rockets that are going up anyway. They First offer it to students for the, uh, free. When you have a free launch like that, amazing things happen to technology. <laughs> Satellite for nothing and a rocket ship for free. It's very exciting to be this close. Micromass will be orbiting next year. At MIT, Dave Malkoff, The Weather Channel.